Yeah, of having the Dr. B. R. Ambedkar Education Institutions was, I think many times you have said that, but it, it is still relevant to once again uh, speak about it. My father was only a 10th class uh, Urdu medium pass, but he had a lot of passion, he had a lot of determination to learn English, to speak English, and uh, because he was a parliament member, he wanted to make a mark by trying to speak in English. So, that was how he started his life. And he felt that let us also start an educational institution which will impart good education to the students. And that's how this concept of starting these institutions here began. And this long journey, actually, uh, if you see the degree college or not, we have completed 50 years. Uh, although the law college is uh, comparatively uh, around 33 years or so, uh, about 33 years uh, the law colleges and uh, it's so nice to see so many students here coming for this ori orientation program and I want to assure all the students here that our institutions have good faculty members, we have a good principal, we have a good dean here and uh, I want the students to take advantage of these institutions. Actually the other day I went to the high court on some work. And I was pleasantly surprised to see many of the advocates who met me, they came and told me, Sir, I am a student of this, your Ambedkar uh, Law College. So, that itself shows that uh, how our alumni is also proud to be associated with this college and how they are achieving good positions in life. I think six months back also, we had an event over here where four of our graduates became district court judges. District court judges? They became district court judges. So it is a, and uh, one of the judges who, who already took charge, she came and said, sir, I'm proud to be part of this institution. I'm proud to be here because I learned so much. There's a very good culture in this institution. My principal and my staff have been very supportive of us. And uh, the, all these things helped me to come to this position. So it was a very inspiring speech when you hear one of your own students who have achieved good positions in life to come and speak about the institution and motivate their colleagues to see why when I can achieve this, why you all can't achieve it. So that is a, this is a good platform and I want to assure all the students here that just now as the principal rightly mentioned, there are a lot of uh, moot court uh, uh, experiences here. There are a lot of uh, English speaking skills development taking place. And uh, I, just before speaking, my wife was just telling me, go share your experiences. Actually, I am a doctor of medicine. I got into business, then I got into politics. But during my tenure in business, I used to see a lot of the cases which our company was handling. I also used to see a lot of our personal cases which we, we have. So whenever I read an affidavit, I want to just share this experience with you. Reading the affidavit itself was a good experience for me. Because I read so many affidavits that today I am capable of preparing an affidavit myself on any issue. So you are all graduates. So, preparing an affidavit, as the, our principal rightly said, that is the most important element to start with. So, you all need to learn that. Practice how to write affidavits. Practice skill, how to speak English, how to present yourself in court. And I think our um, uh, Mr. Vidya Sagar is here. Vidya Dhar Bhatgaru is here. He will also tell you how important it is to have court.